I have been in love with Bren recently. Um, Bren is a hero that kind of plays like Alex, I feel like. If you spike really hard and make it to turn 5, you easily just win with uh, Poison and Divine Shield Murlocs. I always force Murlocs with the hero. But you can sometimes get top 8 as well. So uh, there's a lot of different ways you can play Bren. And I've had a lot of fun with him, uh, a lot of good games. So uh, if you're having trouble with him, maybe my playstyle will help you. Maybe this game can show you how to get the most out of the hero. So um, yeah, enjoy the video. Um, no beast makes brand po- No, no, we don't talk about brand pogo, okay? <laughs> it's not, not an option. No, but I always check if murlocs and pirates are in. Those are the most important ones because then murlocs, obviously you want to use the zero power for murlocs. And uh, how I play him, I stay on tier 1 and I do like Rafam Curve. So you farm the triple on Tide Hunter and on Rockpool Hunter. Usually those triples are super easy to get. So you got two triples by like turn 4. And then you try to triple into 4 star units. And if Pirates are in, if you just hit a Grubber, you win the game. If you had an early Grubber, you can go Menagerie. You don't even have to go Murlocs at that point. You can do whatever you want. You have something that grows like plus 6, plus 6 a turn for free. Um... Or you could triple into 3 stars to look for murloc buffs, but I'm not a huge fan of that. If I can go for a 4, I'd rather do that than for a 3. Because if we go for a 4, that means that we have to level to 3, so I can just roll buffs instead. That's much better than trying to triple into it. Um... Which one is better to buy here? I do freeze. this guy because now this could value trade this probably value trades it's just one murloc so we put this first okay there there's a mech lady in lobby though max is generally good against uh, against me but, well, that's a good shop. I don't even have to hero power. So, okay, next turn it can become awkward, right? Because next turn we could hit our triple. No, actually, this is perfect. So now we just level. If we don't have the triple in our shop, we hero power into it. Um, and then we just freeze and buy something random. Turn after we just level again. And then we buy the triple into a 4 star. Seems good. I could even buy Swabby and then my goal works out better. Then I can go for the triple a turn earlier. Sell this dude, sell Swabby. Yeah. Yeah, if we had a Swabby in our shop, that'd be pretty good for me. Because then my gold works out very nicely. Give me both triples and a swabby. That's one. Oh, I got the swabby actually. Nice. Like the cup is not even actually club swabby is actually the best pick here because cup only is like a tree tree. It's not that good. Um. So next turn it'll be five gold. We'll be at seven. So I can just wait six. I'll be at seven. Yeah, swabby is insane. We can just sell this and get the triple. I choose you. Po no, no, dude. Po I tried Pogo's brand once, I got 8th place, and that has scarred me for life. I don't think I can ever go back to that, that black hole that I ever visited of forcing Merlux with a 0. No. Never again. <laughs> At least not on this account, on an A maybe, but on a U, dude. I, if I get 8th place, I lose like 120 MMR. That takes a 2nd place and a 1st place to get back. I'm not ready. I'm not ready for that, man. Um, okay, the cat. The cat wins, but this was a weak turn for us. Next turn... Oh, just hit the grabber one time. One time. Oh, one time, please. That's not grubber. So yeah, now we, we're in, on 2-3, we can just roll murloc buffs, but... 
Gerber would have made this game so much easier. Pirate transition? No. No, I'll just take egg. Snowy has a cleave, so I don't really have to play around it, but like just in case you get Sarah's into cleave. <laughs> just in case Sarah's into four Reaper is a thing, I guess I'll play around it. I would not be surprised at how high rolling this uh these games can be. But we're still doing really well health wise. This guy's going pogos, but he doesn't have yeah, it's not that strong. It's strong enough to beat us, but... Um, nice! If I had right side here, we'd tie. Oh, that's very good. We could hit another triple. Mm, okay. So normally, normally I hard roll for uh, Marlock best at this point. This is decent though because it activates my egg. I might just take it, I have two more rolls. Oh fuck me. <laughs> God damn it dude. I guess a spawn. I'm gonna stay on tier 3 because this turn was too weak. We gotta stabilize a bit first. When I hit a triple, I can go to 4 and triple into a 5. Now it's too late for Gerber. Last turn and this turn was still early enough for a Gerber, but I think. If we triple now, we go into a 5 rather than a 4, because Burgurgle, Brand, and Lookout are much more, have much more potential now than a Grubber. Um, just unfortunate. Also, my hero power just gave me trash, sadly. But... Oh, we're gonna take it super hard here, wow. Can I kill this thing? Uh about the same. Yeah, Adora feels okay, man. It's good. I could be a triple. Just in case? I don't want to keep this pair around, but I want to keep the cold lights here pair around probably. So I think we do sell both of these for double sear. Do I still keep this around actually? I could sell this. Because Grubber is probably not gonna come in anymore. Unless I guess we had two more triples. Uh, I'll keep the more look. Yeah, this turn wasn't too good. I don't even know if freezing is correct because you got two pairs. Probably not. I just froze because I was running out of time, but the more that I think about it, the more that that was probably a misplay. Because if we hero power, we want to hit a triple so we can level into a 5. Otherwise I don't have the gold, I think, if I hit it now. Can I stop feeding this Vex Rider? Okay, we win. This guy is super weak, wow. He's relying purely on Vex Riders with like, super weak dragons on his board. He took Hangry, that's why he got cursed. 
Um, I can actually go for it if I hit the triple. Easy. Does I come out? Like, if we hit Begurgle, I'd rather have this on my board than Egg. I don't think we need Bran right now, I'd rather hit Begurgle than Bran. If I hit Bran, I might just die. Begurgle is a huge spike. I'm thinking whether it's Egg or 4-4. Four, four. I think it's the 4-4. Four, four. This is too strong still. Even with Begurgle, this is stronger than the 4-4. Four, four. Dude, these guys are so high HP, but no attack. Okay. Okay, okay. It's actually fine, we can do Menagerie now. We got Mech, we got Murloc. <laughs> it's no beast though. Uh, Baron is decent, but it, is, it only works with Egg. Bellmaster. Yeah, I think Murlocs are a bit too ambitious at this point. Ah, uh, maybe not, it depends, right? We can do Menagerie and we can still transition to Murlocs, back to Murlocs. Uh, I do think I'd chill on tier 4 for a turn, because, um... Die! Nice, okay, so we still win this. Yeah, we do chill because Toxfins are super good. We have high health units with no attack. If you have Toxfins, our board is nuts. And then we can just level. Okay. I still see a future for us. That's good. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I also see a good Menagerie for us. I don't want to waste gold on an egg. I uh. No, I don't want to waste gold on an egg. It can maybe be a triple, but it might also not stay in. I don't care about this. It's not that easy to triple either. And we can't put it in. We would keep it in our hand. I'd rather find a good Menagerie target. Because... Okay. What if we had Begurgle now? Then it would be... It would still be okay, I guess. Do we buy this first? I don't think so. Second Lightfinger Begurgle. Oh fuck me. This is a hard one. Begurgle is stronger right now. Lightfang... Has to be Begurgle. Okay, we can still go Murlocs, guys. Game is saved. Game is saved. Eliadrin, what's up? How are you? Like, if I take second light thing, we only have mech Murloc. It would do very little here. And we would probably lose the fight. We could transition to Menagerie. But with Begurgle, like, we spiked super hard here. Now we actually have a shot at getting back at, into Murlocs. I feel like I can just level now. Press my hero power and be safe. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. What a weird game. Ah, uh, nothing I want to, sadly. We're up against that dude, that's also pretty pog. Okay. So what is the dream? The dream is to roll into Bran. We can keep this egg in for a little bit, I guess. That's yeah, a very interesting board. Um... But I'll, I'll, this game is interesting because we were forcing Murlocs, then we had Menagerie option. So if I didn't hit Begurgle, I could go Menagerie. That's why I didn't play this first. If I hit a good Dragon or whatever, we had a Dragon buff in our shop as well. If I hit a good Menagerie target from my triple, I would fully commit to Menagerie. I would just rely on my egg, on probably one or two or maybe three big Murlocs. Whatever I hit from my triple, and just transition. 
Um, but because we took we, we found Burgurgle, I think we can now get back into Murlocs. Only issue is that we're still not that strong. Like we were strong enough to beat that guy. Like we barely beat people, but these guys have ten attack. Like we're gonna lose to Max for sure. Max is gonna destroy us. So next turn better be good. Is Menagerie ever still an option? Maybe. It's not completely off the table. What what would give me Menagerie here? What am I? What would I be looking for? And this guy might be strong as well. He just lost to Adora, but I mean, Adora seems insane. So he might be. He might even beat me. Cause we didn't do anything here for a turn either. Okay, not that strong. Relying on a Golden Wax Rider. Although Golden Wax Rider might be strong enough to beat me. Nah, never mind. So. When would I still go Menagerie at this point? I don't think I will. It's too much gold, right? I need like three, at least three or two more good units to fill a Menagerie. That's a whole turn. No, we always stick with Merlocks and we just hope that it works out. We're already top five, that's fine. Oh! Oh my fucking god. Yeah, I mean, we're Murlocs. What, what can I say, dude? So the thing is, this could be a triple Begurgle. Do I play the Begurgle first or second? <sighs> can also hit triple Felfin. That's probably more likely. I'll play it first. Triple Felfin. I'm so good at this game. I'm so good. I kind of wanted the Toxfin actually, we should have taken Toxfin first, I think. Megasaur. The turn would have been even better with a brand on the board, but I'm gonna take what I can get, this is fine. I don't like any of these, I might honestly sell it just to buy Toxfin. Because I misplayed, I should have bought Toxfin first. I was just too happy with our triple. Um... Because I want to keep the Burgurgle on the board. A Burgurgle is better than an Imp Mama. Gengar's is not that good. Nadina is pretty bad. I, I'm going to sell my 6. It has no use to me. A Burgurgle is better and a Toxfin than having a, a random 6 on the board, I think. Okay, yeah, we spiked pretty hard here. Our egg is still too strong to give up on. Look how big this got. How did that even happen? Jesus Christ. Whoa, whoa. Double Caligos. We need to kill this guy. We can't kill him. He has double Caligos. But only recently. Look, they got four buffs. I think he only just found double Caligos. So, next turn is gonna get pretty big, but uh, we need his next opponent to kill him. Otherwise, we're screwed. Okay, we're up against the max, let's see. You could even consider leveling at this point. Yeah, you could consider leveling. Um, it's pretty good. This is plus, this definitely is plus 10 plus 10. I can give everything plus 10 HP and plus 4 plus 4, so it's not worth it. Yeah, either level next turn, we probably should have leveled this turn though, I think. Because all we can look for now is Bran or Triple Begurial, it's very specific. Because buffs like these are not gonna make me much stronger on this current board. What is gonna make me stronger is Divine Shields. Um, yeah, I think we should have leveled here. But we should be strong enough, we're on 23 HP still, we're not gonna get one shot by anyone. Um, I'm happy to see a good brand game again though. Even though we kinda low rolled our triples, I guess Ag isn't really a, a low roll. No, we didn't low roll at all, we got Ag into Bugurgle. Just whenever I don't hit the... Um, um, 
the pirates, the Gerber, I feel like a low roll, which is probably not, not true. If I get one shot by someone though, I'm gonna be upset. This game could be an easy first, but yeah, we should have leveled here. Because even if I lose a fight, I'm fine with that. But yeah, next turn we level. It's pretty big, but I think we might be bigger. Yeah, we're definitely bigger. Uh, this guy's dead. So we top 4 guaranteed, probably top 3. We can pivot from Murloc to Murloc. Actually, I want to do that once, uh, just for the meme. Like, do a full Murloc transition while I am Murlocs with Brand Khadgar. Just sell my entire board of Murlocs and just create a new one. It sounds very stupid, but it sounds like a, a fun, a fun clip that I can use. I don't know. I like setting challenges for myself. Wow, this guy lost to Yog with Dragon. Oh yeah, this is a double card. Like that means he's very, very weak, right? Because Yog wasn't that strong when we faced him. Oh fuck! I should level. Why the hell? Why does my brain work like this? I. I'm so used to just clicking the hero power at the start of the turn, fuck me. Okay, okay dude. Oh, we hit Megastar anyway. <laughs> Wait, we got it here. Never, never punished, guys. Imagine getting punished. Uh, just give me shields. Poison will work. Okay, nice order, almost 13k man. Thank you, I appreciate it, Captain. Uh, we should probably play around Cleave against this lady. And I, I'll use this as a bump. Using a poison as a bump is pretty bad, but I... Okay, so I'd rather play a bump or around Cleave. I actually don't know. I think both are important. So we could have even sold this to get another adept, but honestly, I think it's fine because if we find Bren, we need two spots on our board anyway. Then the egg can come out. Uh, but I think we'd rather play a bump. It's very likely that he has a divine shield taunt. It is possible that he has cleave, but you can't play around everything. So I'd rather play around the more likely things. Mm. No cleave, but he does have a divine shield taunt. Nice, perfect. Yeah, he loses because we got we're just too strong. This is why I'm not 13k, you never make mistakes. <laughs> Guys, everyone makes mistakes, okay? Even the best players make mistakes. I'm not I'm not close to being the best, so definitely I'll be making mistakes. Yeah, cool brand game. We can still- oh my god, no one died. <clears throat> we can still somehow lose this, I feel like. I'm not sure how, but I think we can. Double Jug feels- it's so, it's pretty strong because it buffs the Divine Shield unit. But it feels unnecessary because his dragons are going to be insanely big anyway. Megastar is just much better. Divine Shield. Never lucky. Does the mech come out now? Because we could give it. If it has Divine Shield, we could give it poison with um, Toxfin. Um, this only adapts three times, though. The chances of it getting good adapts is very low. I think we just roll. Mainly for Ghoul, I think. Oh, we did get the Vine Shield! Okay, dude. Alright, we could actually lose this, right? If he has Nadina, he could just value trade all my Murlocs with his huge dragons with double Caligos. Uh, no Nadina, so we win. He's dead. That's unlucky for him, he got an insane Dragon Ball. 
um, that he transitioned into as well. Like he found two Kaligos, it's pretty late, and then he just decided to go dragons. There was a ghoul, was there actually a ghoul? Did I miss the ghoul? Oh god. Yeah, I can you tell that this is the first coffee of the day? I misplayed this game like three times maybe? Small misplays though, but still. I was still winning, like Okay. Yeah, I can come out now. Where the hell is my shield? What the fuck, dude? Winfrey? Against another Murloc player, I think Winfrey is... Is that better? I'll take poison so we don't have to take the Toxfin, I think. So we can save our gold. Three adepts, no. I mean, we got plants, poison, and. No. The fuck? How's that supposed to help me? We could end on this. Oh, I could believe and roll a couple more times. Shit, he could have a better Murloc belt than me because I don't have Bran. I'm gonna end on this just to be safe. But I feel like we're fucked. We need a shield. We have plants, we have big stats, we have poison, but without shields, uh, I lose the mirror. This game has been so good, it, yeah, it has been, yeah. There is shields, but he doesn't have poison, but his stats are big enough to one-shot my Murlocs. So that's an issue. He doesn't have poison on everything yet, but he has the stats to still... Val Dude, that hit was perfect! Hit a plant. Nice! Now we still win. Wait, Kek, wait. No, we don't. We No, we win because plants. No, we don't. Yeah, we do. We do. Ben, I gotta shut up. I swear to God. Oh, but we don't kill him, so we have another turn. We only won because we took the selfless hero. Without selfless hero, I would have lost this. Uh, is the stats worth with the poisonous shop? Um, no, I don't. Didn't want to waste three gold just on poison. Plus one, plus one is not worth it. I think in a murloc mirror. Apparently it is because it doesn't have poison on everything. But I didn't know that. I think I'd rather just um, save the three, three gold to roll for a mega sword. I just got another triple, I think you're fucked. Yeah, no mega sorry feels bad. So if the fight went like last time we should win again, but I'm sure he's gonna be stronger now. He doesn't have a brand either though, seven Murlocs, so even if he gets Mega Sword, he could still low roll. But if he finds plants we have um we can lose. Ghoul, I'm not Was there ever was there a ghoul in my shop again? Skipped again? I wasn't looking for a ghoul. Like ghoul is good. But I don't know. You should have taken a ghoul. It's a safe play. Ghoul is a safe play. I'd rather just only look for Mega Sword though. This this was good enough to win his last fights. But yeah, I should have taken ghoul probably. You're right. Although we have a lot of HP, that's the thing. We don't have to uh to take it necessarily. Like if these things oh he needs to hit my plants with those things. Nice. Yeah, if he just hits my plants, oof. Oh my god, that hits. Wait, we're still fine. Yeah, we still win this. Easy. So, Ghoul is a super safe play, I guess. 
But we didn't have to go for it. With 23 HP, we up against Murlocs that doesn't deal too much damage. If we just hit Megastar, we always win the game. So.